Hello and welcome to Someco Business Plan Template for Google Sheets. To use the template, make sure you are online and sign in with your Google account. Then you have to make a copy of this file. Just go to File, then click on Make a Copy. Business Plan is a written document to give an overview of a company. And with this tool, you will save a huge amount of time with predefined sections and detailed guiding. This template has seven main sections, including this navigation page, cover section, introduction, marketing, organization, financials, and lastly, the summary section. On the navigation menu, you can navigate through the template with the buttons. You can also track your progress with checkboxes. Start with the cover of your business plan. Just write the company name, contact info, writers of the plan, and date. And you can change the logo. Just click on this one, then replace image. Then select your file from your computer. And remember, this is a print-ready cover sheet. Under the introduction section, company description and products and services will give a general info about your business. Under company description, you can identify the business name, mission statement, core values, vision statement, legal structure, ownership structure, and headquarters. On the products and services page, you can explain the main properties of your products. Let's dive into marketing section, which consists of six different marketing tools. Industry Analysis. This section gives a general outlook for the business industry, such as the total size of the industry, total size of the target market, targeted market share, market saturation, main location, and future aspects. And you can add general notes about your industry. Target market analysis, you can define the target market of your business with geographical level, demographic level, psychographic level, and behavior level. And competitive analysis section. Here you can evaluate the position against your competitors. First, define the factors, then assign the importance level, and give scores to your company and your competitors. And the overall scores will be calculated here automatically. Additionally, you can add analysis notes in this section. Let's continue with another marketing tool, Porter's Five Forces Analysis. This tool lets you explain the competitive environment with power of buyers, power of suppliers, threat of new entrants, threat of substitutes, and competitive rivalry. Just write down your notes to understand your competition challenges. Let's continue with the SWOT analysis. This common tool helps you to evaluate a business with strengths, weaknesses, opportunities, and threats. You will find a detailed note about what to put on each section. And the last section of the marketing is distribution. In this part, you can give the main idea about the distribution channels of your business. Just add a distribution channel, then write down your notes about that particular distribution channel. Let's continue with the organization section, management and HR. The first section on the top is for the key managers of your business, name, position, and expertise area. The second part on the bottom is to define the human resources structure of your company. Just enter the department, estimated personnel number, average yearly salary, and the template calculates the total estimated cost for the human resources. Financial section consists of sales forecast, income statement, balance sheet, cash flow statement, and financial summary. Let's check the sales forecast first. This section gives a prospect of your sales projections for each target market for five year period. You can change the years if you want, then you can put the new target markets. And once you enter the sales for each year, total sales and year over year growth will be calculated here. Financial statement provide ready-to-use income statement balance sheets and cash flow statements for five-year financial projections. White areas are for you to input data, while the gray areas are calculations. On the financial statements, you may change the years on the top 
But we highly recommend you use the same five year period for the sales forecast and financial statements in order to get the accurate financial summary results. Let's check the financial summary section. This dashboard is produced from the previous sales forecast and financial statement sheets. This template displays a clear financial outlook for the five-year projections of your business, with key ratios and professional charts, such as sales projections, expected profit and loss, total asset predictions, and cash flow predictions. Finally, this summary section gives a general idea of your business, and there are three main parts here. Let's start with Business Model Canvas. This tool helps you to summarize the key drivers of your business in nine main blocks with drag and drop post-it notes. You can easily move these notes and write out the necessary titles. Business Timeline. This list shows the expected milestones of the business with target dates. This will give a smooth drop map of the company. And lastly, let's check the executive summary. This is one of the most important sections of a business plan. The executive summary gives you a chance to explain your business to the targeted audience with your own words. This page underlines the main description goals and prospect of your business. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to check our other templates at somica.net.